The thing I will miss the most is the camaraderie. It's really nice to have a cohort of people that you know will be around and you like share classes and like that that comfort that you'll be able to share ideas and have that kind of artistic exchange without looking for it. Just having that group of people that you know will be there that you can work and collaborate with that will challenge you and to help you challenge yourself. What I'm going to miss about CFA the most is working with the different faculty within my music program. Since I'm doing a Bachelor of Arts, I'm able to jump between different, different programs, different faculties within the department and it's really widened my scope. Oh, the people, absolutely the people. I have met so many like incredible, amazing friends here and I just feel so lucky to be around all of these amazing people every single day. The best piece of advice I have got from someone at this school was to always move with gratitude and kindness and joy because our business and, and art and everything is about people, it's about human beings. And so you always wanna treat everyone as a person first, be moving through and talking to people and making sure that you're always keeping that humanity in your sight line. I think the biggest advice that I've gotten is that you get out what you put in, but there's so many resources here and so many people that are wanting and excited to uplift you and uplift your talent. So just take every opportunity. We put a lot of focus on improving our art, but it's also about improving who you are as a person. And the better you become as a person, the better your art will become. It's not a competitive nature. It's more focused on improving and being there for each other. There's such a sense of community. Everyone, like no matter what their major is, no matter like what school they're in, like they want to hear about what you're doing. There's like such a crossover between all of our, our creative practices. I think it makes it hard to, hard to leave for sure. I think what I will miss most about CFA is the community that we built. All these years, people that I worked with, professors and the students, the camaraderie, the conversations, the challenges. I think something that I'll cherish more when I leave is just the ability to sort of be in a community of people that are always rooting for you. Like not having the question of who will show up if I just want to make something that makes no sense, or if I want to make something that means everything to me, who will be in the audience? And seeing those same faces revolving, I think I'll, I'll cherish that more once I leave because it was so constant here. I'm gonna miss my studio space the most because I kind of made it into my little nest of sorts. I'm gonna miss it so much. The biggest thing that CFA does, for me, for sure, is just the collaboration. Like this, this idea that the best work that could be made is when people are giving their all to each other. There's, there's just something about being in close proximity to these people for this long. Like we've all lived together, we've all like gone through college, and yet we're, it's also like an artistic commune in a lot of ways, and everyone's doing all this work together and prioritizing each other, and, and that's a big part of this, yeah. The professors helped me prepare life outside of CFA by helping me dream big and really step outside of my comfort zone by either applying to programs that I didn't think I would get in, or really just pushing my boundaries, and I feel like that's a life skill that can be applicable outside of school, too. Being intellectually challenged on a regular basis, it, it really helped me better myself as a, as a student, and also as an individual, as a teacher. I'd say one word for CFA is inspiring, because just being surrounded by all these incredible artists is like fuel to my creative fire. One word to describe CFA, I think, without a doubt, has to be exploration. Everyone is constantly exploring, pushing the limits of kind of the containers that we've been given and how can we extend and, and make it greater and better than it is right now. It would definitely be life. There's so much life in this building and you will never be alone. There's always people here at all hours of the day. Um, so it's definitely a building full of life. I want people to know that the class of 2024 was absolutely resilient. That we're really resilient. That we are resilient. I have really learned the quality of resilience here. One word to describe CFA besides resilient would probably be curious. A lot of people like want to hear about what you're doing and they want to know how their practice can fit into yours and, and how we can collaborate. And I think that people are just really, really curious about all the overlapping art that's happening. 24 really represents this idea of expanding what we already know, experimenting on things that no one's ever tried before, new people, new ideas, new voices, all really critical to, I think, our modern artistic world. And I think 24 encapsulates that fantastically.